coming off a tie against the Jaguars in Jacksonville. The Jets return back home and look to continue their winning streak. They're now playing a better team, the 6-6 six six Oakland Raiders. Can the Jets continue to win or will they have their first loss in a while? Make sure you watch the entire video so you don't miss out. The Raiders are moving downfield, third down at the 35, looking to pass his car. Upfield, it is completed for a first down and more, and he's into the end zone for the touchdown. The Raiders score first, and it's 7-0. Now the Jets are moving downfield, first down at the 32-yard line. Wilson gets a snap, looking to pass, looking. Upfield, it is completed for a first down and more. Devontae Falk into the end zone for the touchdown. The Jets tie the game right back up. The Raiders do nothing on their drive now. Second down for the Jets. Fake handoff from Wilson looking to pass. He's going to throw downfield deep. And it is caught one-handed from Defonte Folk for the first down. Jets are moving downfield. Here's the fake handoff from Wilson looking to pass for the end zone. It is caught in the back of the end zone from Devontae Folk for the touchdown. The Jets take the lead. Second down for Derek Carr and the Raiders. Fake handoff from Carr looking to pass. He's under pressure and he fumbles the ball. The Jets will recover the fumble and he is brought down at the 16 yard line. First down at the 16 for the Jets. Wilson gets a snap looking to pass. Quick throw in to the end zone for the touchdown. Devontae Folk again. The Jets take a two touchdown lead. Now the Raiders are moving downfield. Third down at the 20 yard line. Derek Carr gets a snap, looking to pass, looking upfield, and it is completed for a first down and more. He runs into the end zone for the touchdown. Now the Raiders are down by one touchdown. Now second down for the Jets at the 26. Fake handoff from Wilson, looking to pass. He's going to throw it downfield deep, and it is caught by Elijah Moore for the first down. And now on fourth and five, the Jets will just settle for a field goal. Here's the kick. It is up and it is good. The Jets take a 10 point lead. It's 24 14. First down for the Raiders at the 28 yard line. Derek Hart gets a snap handoff over to the left side and he is brought down right away. Josh Jacobs is going nowhere. The Raiders are moving downfield. Third down and four at the 12 yard line. Derek Hart gets a snap looking to pass upfield. It is caught and it is a touchdown. The Raiders get a big touchdown. And it is now a three-point game. Third down and four now for the Jets. Wilson gets a snap, fake handoff, looking to pass, looking. He's going to throw upfield. It is intercepted by the Raiders. Down the field, and he is finally brought down at 39-yard line. First and goal. Raiders looking to score before the half. Derek Carr looking to pass for the end zone. It is intercepted by the Jets. And he has all day to run. No defenders in sight. Down the sideline to the 30, to the 20, to the 10. And he is in the end zone for a 100-yard pick six. That is a huge momentum grabber for the Jets. They take a 10-point lead right before the half. The Jets look to score again before the half. Here's a snap from Wilson. Looking to pass. He's going to throw a field. It is completed to midfield for a first down. With four seconds before the half, the Jets will just kick a field goal. The kick is up, and it is no good. We head into halftime remaining. 31-21, Jets retake the lead, and they stay in the lead at the half. Can the Jets' defense continue to play well? Watch the rest of the video so you don't miss out. The Raiders are driving downfield to start the second half. First and go at the one-yard line handoff over to the right side. And he pushes his way into the end zone for a touchdown. What a way to start the second half for the Raiders. Now first down for the Jets about midfield. Here we go. Wilson gets a snap. Fake handoff rolling out to his left. Looking to pass for the end zone. It is completed at the 10-yard line for a first down. Looking to retake a 10-point lead. Wilson gets a snap looking upfield. It is completed to Elijah Moore for the touchdown. The Jets retake a 10-point lead in the second half. Now third down and three at the 40-yard line. Handoff over to the left side. And he is through the hole. He sheds multiple tackles down the sideline to the 10. All the way in for the touchdown. 
A massive run from Josh Jacobs, and the Raiders are back in the game. The Jets do nothing on their drive now. The Raiders are moving downfield. Here's a snap from Derek Carr looking to pass. He's under pressure for the end zone, and that's a touchdown. The Raiders retake the lead here early in the third quarter. 37 seconds before the fourth quarter. Jets driving downfield. Here's a snap for Wilson looking to pass for the end zone. It is intercepted in the end zone from the Raiders. Start of the fourth quarter, Raiders do nothing on their drive. Jets moving downfield once again. Wilson looking to pass, looking for the end zone again. It is intercepted again by the Raiders down the sideline. Wilson cannot tackle him. Another defender misses and he is all the way. And that is a pick six from the Raiders from the end zone, just like earlier in the game that the Jets had. A big drive for the Jets, third down at the 34. Here we go, Wilson gets a snap, looking pass, he's going to throw it downfield deep. It is completed, and the defender misses all the way down to the six-yard line. Now fourth and goal for the Jets. They will go for it at the one-yard line. Here's a handoff over to the right side, and he is stopped short. The Raiders will get the ball back at the one-yard line. We will see if the Jets defense can step up here and they're able to run it a little bit outside of the end zone. The Raiders don't do much now. The Jets have it again at the goal line and they're able to push their way into the end zone for the touchdown. Michael Carter with the TD and the Jets get a little bit closer. Now going for a two point conversion to make it a closer game. A three point game if they get this. Here's a snap to Wilson looking to pass upfield it is deflected two-point conversion is no good Raiders do nothing on their drive now second down for the Jets looking to pass upfield it is intercepted by the Raiders and that could be the game that might have just lost the Jets the game they're down by five with two minutes left in the game first down at the 18 yard line for Las Vegas Carr gets a snap looking to pass looking he's under pressure he throws it downfield deep and it is intercepted by the Jets. That's a massive interception. And he is finally brought down out of the 43. Elijah Dunn with the interception. And that might save the game. One timeout to work with. Fourth down for the Jets. They have to convert. Wilson passing upfield. It is broken up. The Raiders give the ball back. And that is the game. The Jets lose by five. They had every opportunity to win this game but turnovers haunted them and in the end the Raiders did play a little bit better even though they turned the ball over a lot as well but overall a great game from both teams the Jets were just not able to pull it off final stats on the day 28 for 54 625 yards Derek Carr 25 for 41 339 yards four touchdowns each but four interceptions for Zach Wilson that really changed the game running we barely could run it 10 for 22 we just couldn't run the ball uh, it, it has been a struggle to run the ball uh elijah moore had a pretty good game denzel mims as well Devonte folk was actually in the game for once Sherlock lincoln had a little bit involvement and even nate richards not bad from our wide receivers honestly defensively i mean earl taylor just continues to perform so well John Franklin Myers as well. Bryce Huff got involved as well. We haven't he heard his name in a good while. But overall, pretty good game. Elijah Dunn, Ashton Davis. Those two guys get interceptions very often. Really good game. Yeah, we lost. We're 7-5-1. Our future is bright. I really have high hopes for the season, for this team. Next up, we play the 5-8 and eight Buffalo Bills. Can we pull off a win against a division rival keep in mind we have two games and then we play them again at home we have to win these games and we need to win the division let me know do you think we will win the division guys subscribe down below if you haven't already so you don't miss out and other than that guys i will catch you guys in my next one